Hi, Linda Kenny here from lindakonline.com. Uh, do you know the difference between wanting and willing to change? If you stay with me, I'll explain exactly what I mean in just a few seconds. Welcome back. I asked the question, do you know the difference between wanting and willing to change? Now, I've written a blog post about this today, but I wanted to do this short video as well. Um, what, what we mainly do is we say we want something. So, for instance, people may say they want to make more money in 2016, for example. Actually wanting to do something but willing to change to achieve that are two different things. And so you have to change your wants and desires into a will to actually want to do something, if that makes any sense to you. When people, for instance, want to start a home-based business online like I have, there has to be a lot of willingness to learn, a lot of willingness to put into action everything you've learned and a willingness to actually keep on doing it. Earning money online in a home-based business, for instance, is not a one day, a one week, a one month commitment. It's a commitment that goes on a lot longer than that because when you first begin, you do not begin to earn money straight away. And if you come into that with that view that you're going to make money immediately, then you're going to be very, very disappointed. And unfortunately, that's one of the biggest reasons why people actually leave the industry. They're not willing to actually change and put in that massive effort that is needed to actually be successful marketing online. I, If you use me as an example, I've invested heavily in my education. I'm part of a mastermind coaching group with Ray Higdon. And yes, it takes a massive commitment from me to attend webinars, to attend training events, and to actually spend some money to get to the events and stay overnight. But I see it as absolutely worth every single effort and time, money I put into that, because that will help me achieve my wants and desires in my home-based business. And if you want to do the same, then you have to be prepared and have a willingness to change so that those wants and desires of yours can actually be achieved. That is the only way I can describe it. Things don't happen overnight. We're none of us overnight success stories. Behind every successful person, you will see a massive, massive amount of work has been put into that. And part of that is that willingness to learn, that willingness to change, and that willingness to put in that effort to make your business successful. So that is the difference between wanting and willing to change. That's me for now. Please visit me at my blog at lindakonline.com. This video is going to go on a blog post I've done on this subject today. If you want to know what I do, then visit travelwithlinda.com and I will put details of that below this video. In the meantime, have a great day and I'll see you in another video.